Surprise. Got your single single. Missed you. Are you, are you stalking me now? Yeah. <laughs> I thought maybe we could go have some uh, breakfast together or something. How are you feeling anyway? I'm fine. Did you take the test? No. I was waiting for you. I thought that maybe we could stop at the pharmacy before or on the way home. This is insane, Miriam. How are you going to raise a child by yourself? Well, I'm not going to raise it by myself, silly. Oh, God. And besides, I have a very successful and lucrative business, flexible hours, and child-friendly, so no problemo. Exactly. You know, sometimes I really question your judgment. What is it going to be every day? Take your child to work, Dad. Liquor is quicker. Hey. What happened in there? Did the doctor say something? I can't do this. Adam, you're bound to get cold feet. I get it, but you know what? This child is going to be fine in our hands. Our hands? There's no us, Miriam. There can't be an us. Of course there's an us. Yeah, Come what, on. What gave you that impression? Well, you just spent two weeks in my bed, Adam, so... Okay, you know what? If you wanted there to be an us, then you actually had to talk to me about it. You know, maybe consult okay, me on this stop before it. you just... Stop it! You are creating a hostile womb environment right now. You need to help me. You know what? Don't tell me what I need to do. Holy fuck, Melanie. This is... Oh. Sorry. Sorry. Oh, sorry. That just slipped out. Oh, really? Come on, I've done pretty well. I haven't called you Melanie once since you transitioned, okay? So ease up. But honestly, Adam, that's who you were in my heart for so long. And I kind of miss the old times, Adam. I don't miss the old times. I hated the old times. Well, I'm old times. So that means you hate me. I am finally happy. Really? Oh, screw you, Miriam. I want out of your life and I want out of your bed. Oh. Adam, wait. Adam, I said I was sorry. Look, this has nothing to do with your transition. I'm thrilled that you're finally happy in your own skin, but if you ask I me. I didn't ask you. Okay, but if you ask me, you were happier before. You have no idea, dude. You have no idea what I went through. So tell me. I have. Tell Again. 35 years, Miriam. I spent 35 years feeling trapped. It's not exactly easy to go through gender reassignment while you're going bankrupt and then have your girlfriend dump you because she doesn't like men. I don't like men? What would give you that idea? That makes no sense. You dump me because you're a lesbian and you don't do guys. As soon as I said I was no. transitioning, it was game over. No, no, that's you. You dumped me. I didn't leave you. What? Yeah, you left me. You don't even remember. Are you fucking crazy, Miriam? I know what you did. You left me because you didn't want to be polyamorous anymore. No. Yes, yes, that was the story. Yes, I remember, I was there, yes. No. And stop following me.